G'day, welcome to another Curriculum Burst. Here's a curious question for middle schoolers. It goes as follows. How many three-digit numbers are divisible by 13? Okay, so what three-digit numbers that are multiples of 13, how many of them are there? All right, okay, well, I guess I can just try stuff. I mean, I know what I'm talking about. I do know what numbers are. I do know what multiples of 13 are. Something, some sense. So I guess really the strategy I want to employ here is number one, just engage in successful flailing. Kind of know what I need to do, don't know what I'm doing though, let's just try stuff out and see what happens. Um, I guess the first thing I want to try out is do I know any three digit numbers that are multiples of 13? And the answer is yes, I mean the obvious one for me is 130, 10 times 13. Actually, that then leads me to think, okay, what's maybe the first three-digit number that's a multiple of 13? I guess I could take 13 away from this. What would it be 120, 117 that's a multiple of 13? Must be, 13 less, and it's still three digits. Uh, 13 less again is 104. All right, so I can see that 104 is the first three-digit number that's a multiple of 13. So I guess the question now is, how high can I get? And then all I have to do is basically just count how many in that list. And I said, all I have to do. This sounds scary. I think it's a bit of work, actually. Um, so I guess the question then is, what's the highest number that is a three digits and still a multiple of 13? How can I think my way through that one? Hmm. Well, one approach, I don't know if it's the best approach, but it's just what's come to my mind right now. I've got the number 104. I've got the number 104 plus 13, which I'm being a little strange here. I've got 104 plus two 13s. 2 times 13, and I'm going to go all the way up to 104 plus some number, I'll just write n for number, of 13s, and I want that to just squeak under 1,000. Alright, so 104 plus 13 n's must be just under 1,000, which I guess tells me that 13 n's needs to be just under 1,000, take away 104, that's what, 900, 896, that is the biggest number I want and to be just under 896 divided by 13. <sighs> I bet I could work that out, see what whole number just squeaks under that value, and that will then tell me something about how many numbers in that list. I feel like, that, feel like that's doable now. I have to think carefully, just make sure I get the details just right, but now I feel like this problem is in grasp. So actually, I'm going to leave the rest of the details to you. See if you can get how many numbers are in this list, which will be the answer to this question, and then compare results. Look at the essay that goes to this video and see what I came up with when I did this too. Alright, this is great stuff. Thanks so much. Thanks for watching. For more curriculum inspirations material, go to our website. Lots of great stuff there.